all around us in Trinidad and Tobago, whether you are in the north or in the central or in the south of this country, the people that we honor and celebrate in our public spaces are not those who fought for our freedom, but those who perpetuated the great crimes of colonialism, genocide, slavery, indentureship, and what followed after emancipation was actually apartheid, separateness and unequalness, deliberate attempts to maintain the status quo. The celebrities, the icons of those great crimes are the people celebrated all around us. Which one of these streets here is Picton Street? Which square is named after Ralph Woodford? Where is Abercrombie Street? Abercrombie and Picton came to the Caribbean to put down the wars of emancipation that our ancestors were waging from Grenada to Haiti. That was their mission, to keep us in slavery. We honor them on streets today. Disgracefully, the country that sent us Picton the country of Wales, they have decided that he is no longer worthy of honor because of the crimes he committed in Trinidad. They've removed his statues, removed his portrait from rooms that honor the heroes of Wales for the crimes he committed in Trinidad. And they did this as a gift to us for emancipation last year. A year has passed and we still have over 10 monuments to that vicious criminal, Governor Thomas Picton.